Well, the verdict is still out regarding how long COVID antibodies actually offer you protection. But now there's growing concern that you can get COVID-19 twice. In fact, a 33-year-old man in Hong Kong was reinfected. Joining me now is infectious disease epidemiologist, Dr. Syra with more insight. So can someone actually get COVID twice? Because there's all this confusion. Once you have it, you're good. I mean, what's the verdict here? There's a limited number of studies right now in terms of reinfection, but uh, it, it is showing that you can get reinfected. We don't know how common this is or whether this is a, a rare occurrence. And we've also seen that people that have been reinfected, you, again, the denominator is very small, but we have seen that people that have been reinfected, the first time it was a mild case, and then the reinfection um, could have been a, a, a severe case. And so it could also be the opposite. And so there's still a lot of investigation happening, but can reinfection happen? Yes, it can. How often? That's something that's still up in the air. And so much about, obviously, uh, COVID-19, we're just figuring out we're on the ground. It's changing every day. We talk about antibodies, which everyone wants because uh, once being infected, the antibodies can help prevent uh, a reinfection or prevent illness, severe illness down the road. But how long can these antibodies last? All the people who have antibodies after being infected, how long are they around for? With COVID-19, we don't know the duration and we don't know the level of immunity quite yet, whether this could be months, it could be years. You know, for chicken pox, this is something where it's one and done. You have immunity for life. That's probably not the case with COVID-19, but it's something that's still currently being explored. And that's why it's, it's, uh, it's, we need to be very cautious of having these immunity passports, meaning that if you've tested positive for antibodies, you're thinking that you can go out and not do these social distancing measures and not wear a mask. It's the complete opposite. So regardless of whether you have antibodies or not, you're going to continue to wear the mask. You're going to continue to do these public health measures like socially distanced. We're living in uncertain times. It's tough to keep up with the latest medical headlines. Panic about the market. Panic about COVID. And how do those headlines impact you and your family? On season 13 of The Doctors, we want to empower you physically. If I met them at dance, they would meet me at medicine. Man, I love that. Emotionally. If I can change my thoughts, I can change my feelings. And medically. He doesn't have his mask up, which is not a good thing. This is the million dollar question, maybe the trillion dollar question. This is so critical for people to hear. We're giving you the inside track on health and wellness so that you can get back to the life you deserve. It's time to take back your power. The Doctors, now more than ever, premieres September 21st.